Beloved, we all encounter times when life feels uncertain and making decisions is tough. Many of us struggle to find the strength to handle daily challenges and fears. Remember, God's power can make a difference in your everyday life. I'll pray with you in Jesus' name. So stay tuned and be open to receiving the blessings of this prayer. Think of a hiker using a modern GPS to navigate unfamiliar terrain. Just as the GPS provides direction, strength, and assurance to reach the destination, God offers us His wisdom, power, and blessings for our journey. The Bible says in James 1 verse 5 that if anyone lacks wisdom, they should ask God, who gives generously without finding fault. When we rely on this divine strength, we can overcome any challenge and achieve our purpose. Trust in God's power within you and see how your life can change in ways you never imagined. Let's focus on seeking divine guidance for our daily decisions. Dear friends, how often do we find ourselves at a crossroads, unsure of which path to choose? Each day we face many decisions, from minor choices to major ones. In these times, we need more than our own understanding. We need more than our own understanding. We need divine wisdom to guide us. The good news is that God is ready to guide us. He is not distant or indifferent, but a loving Father who wants us to live our best lives. Proverbs 3, verse 5 to 6 offers a powerful promise. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and don't rely on your own understanding. In all your ways, acknowledge Him and He will make your paths straight. This verse is more than a comforting idea. It's a call to action. It urges us to trust God fully, even when His guidance doesn't seem clear to us, and to involve Him in every part of our lives, not just the big decisions. So, how do we seek God's guidance practically? First, make prayer a regular habit. Talk to God throughout your day, sharing your thoughts, worries, and hopes. Second, immerse yourself in the Bible, which is full of wisdom and guidance. As you read, ask God to speak to you through His Word. Also, pay attention to the Holy Spirit's gentle nudges. Learn to recognize this still, small voice by spending time in God's presence. Seeking God's guidance is not about getting a detailed map of your life, but about building a close relationship with the one who knows the way. As you walk with Him daily, His guidance will become clearer and your path will seem more certain. Life often presents challenges that seem overwhelming. We face fears and obstacles that can paralyze us. In these times, we need more than our own strength. We need God's power to lift us and carry us through. The comforting truth is that God's strength is always available. He doesn't promise a life without difficulties, but He does promise to be with us through them. In Isaiah 41 verse 10, we get this reassuring message. Don't be afraid, for I am with you. Don't be discouraged, for I am your God. I will strengthen you. I will help you, and I will help you, and I will hold you up with my righteous hand. This verse reminds us that we are never alone in our struggles. God is always there, ready to give us strength. He doesn't just offer a little help. He supports us with His mighty hand. To tap into this divine strength, start by acknowledging your weakness. Recognizing that you can't handle everything on your own opens the door to God's power. Next, trust in His promises. The Bible is filled with assurances of His support. Reflect on these promises and let them deeply influence you. Finally, act in faith. God's strength often becomes clear when we step out in obedience, even if we're afraid. Remember, God's strength isn't just for major crises. It's for everyday challenges, too. Whether you're dealing with a tough conversation, resisting temptation, or tackling a difficult task, know that you have access to a power greater than any challenge. You're not relying on your own strength, but on the power of Almighty God. Additionally, focus on the blessings and protection God offers. In a world full of uncertainty, we often worry about our safety, our loved ones, and our future. 
but God wants us to live fully in his blessings and under his protection. Psalm 91 verse 1 to 2 beautifully expresses this. Whoever dwells in the secret place of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress, my God, in whom I trust. These verses show how God's presence shields us and keeps us safe. To live in this place of blessing and protection, seek to dwell in His presence daily. To live with God at the center of our lives, we need to make Him a priority, not just an afterthought. First, we should choose to focus on God and make Him central to everything we do. Second, trust in His goodness. Sometimes God's blessings may not look like what we expect, but He knows what's best for us even when things seem tough. Third, be grateful for His blessings. Thankfulness helps us see all the ways God is already blessing us. Remember, God's blessings and protection aren't just about material wealth or physical safety. They include our relationships, peace of mind, and spiritual growth. Each day, recognize that you're under God's open blessings and His protection surrounds you like a shield. As we pray, let these truths deeply touch your heart. God is ready to guide you, strengthen you, and shower you with blessings. Embrace this divine power and let it transform your life day by day. With God by your side, you have everything you need to face whatever comes your way. Trust in His guidance, rely on His strength, and find rest in His blessings. Your life can be a testament to His glory. Walk confidently, knowing that the God of the universe is working everything for your good. Now, let's go to the Lord in prayer. I invite you to join me so you can receive the full blessings of this prayer. Let's pray. Almighty God, creator of the heavens and the earth, I come before you with reverence and thanksgiving. Your majesty fills the heavens and your love reaches every corner of the earth. You are the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, the one who was, is, and will be. Your wisdom is infinite and your power is boundless. Heavenly Father, we come before you today with grateful hearts, recognizing your boundless love and faithfulness. We thank you for all the blessings you have given us and for the promises of your word that guide us. As we pray, we ask for your guidance to ensure we don't miss the blessings you have prepared for us. Lord, we acknowledge that you are sovereign and in control of everything in our lives. You are the creator of the universe and the one who knows what's best for us. We trust that you have a plan for each of us, filled with blessings and opportunities. Help us to understand that every blessing comes from your hand and is a part of your divine plan. May we never take for granted the good things you have already provided. Father, we ask for your help in becoming more aware of the blessings you are placing in our lives. Open our eyes to recognize the opportunities, gifts, and favors you are giving us each day. Sometimes we are so focused on our problems or desires that we miss the small, everyday blessings. Help us to be attentive and grateful for all that you provide big or small. Lord, guide us in our decisions and actions. Sometimes we are unsure of which path to take or how to respond to life's challenges. We ask for your wisdom to lead us in the right direction so we do not miss out on the blessings you have in store for us. Give us clear understanding and direction in every area of our lives, our relationships, work, and personal goals. Heavenly Father, we come against any doubt and fear that might hinder us from receiving your blessings. Doubts about your promises or fears about our inadequacies can block us from experiencing the fullness of what you have prepared. Strengthen our faith and remove any barriers of disbelief that prevent us from embracing your goodness. Help us to trust you fully, even when we cannot see the whole picture. Lord, teach us to trust in your perfect timing. Sometimes we become impatient and try to rush things according to our own schedules. We may miss the blessings you have for us because we are not waiting on your timing. 
Help us to be patient and to understand that your timing is always best. Teach us to wait on you with hope and expectation. Father, cultivate in us a heart of gratitude. When we are thankful for what we have, we open ourselves to receive more of your blessings. Help us to regularly express our gratitude, not just in words, but in our actions and attitudes. A thankful heart is a receptive heart, ready to recognize and enjoy all the good things you are giving us. Lord, remove any obstacles or distractions that may be keeping us from fully receiving your blessings. Sometimes our focus is pulled away by worries, fears, or worldly concerns. Help us to keep our eyes on you and to eliminate anything that prevents us from experiencing the fullness of your blessings. Strengthen our commitment to follow your path and to stay focused on your will. Heavenly Father, protect us from any attacks or schemes of the enemy that aim to steal our blessings. We know that the enemy tries to distract, deceive, and discourage us from receiving what you have prepared. We ask for your protection and deliverance from all evil that seeks to hinder us. Strengthen us against any spiritual attacks and help us to stand firm in your truth. Lord, help us to be obedient to your word and guidance. Sometimes we may miss our blessings because we are not following your commands or living according to your will. Teach us to be obedient in every aspect of our lives, from our thoughts and actions to our decisions and relationships. Through our obedience, may we fully experience the blessings you have in store for us. Father, deepen our relationship with you. The closer we are to you, the more we can understand and receive your blessings. Help us to spend more time in prayer, studying your word, and seeking your presence. As our relationship with you grows, so will our ability to recognize and appreciate the blessings you are providing. Lord, once we receive your blessings, grant us the wisdom to manage them wisely. Blessings are not just gifts to be enjoyed, but responsibilities to be stewarded. Help us to use the blessings you give us in ways that honor you and benefit others. Teach us to be good stewards of everything you have entrusted to us. Heavenly Father, renew our minds and spirits. Sometimes our thinking or emotional state can prevent us from recognizing and enjoying your blessings. Purify our thoughts and renew our spirits to be aligned with your will. Help us to have a clear and positive mindset that is open to the good things you are bringing into our lives. Lord, surround us with a supportive community that helps us to recognize and receive your blessings. Sometimes having the right people around us can make a big difference. Bring people into our lives who encourage us. Pray for us and help us see the blessings you are providing. Help us to also be a source of support and encouragement to others. Father, help us to release our need for control and surrender to your will. Our attempts to control every aspect of our lives can sometimes block us from receiving your blessings. Teach us to let go and trust in your plan, knowing that you have our best interests at heart. When we surrender to your will, we open ourselves to receive the fullness of your blessings. Lord, give us the strength to endure through difficult times. Even when we face trials, help us to remain steadfast and trust in your promises. Sometimes our blessings come after a period of testing. Give us the strength to persevere and hold on faith, knowing that you are working all things for our good. Heavenly Father, help us to live a lifestyle of faith. Faith is not just about believing in your promises, but living in a way that reflects our trust in you. Guide us to live with faith-filled actions and attitudes, confident that you are providing and blessing us in every way. Lord, teach us to celebrate small victories along the way. Often, we focus only on big blessings and overlook the smaller ones. Help us to recognize and be thankful for every step forward, no matter how small. Celebrating these moments helps us to remain encouraged and aware of your ongoing work in our lives. Father, we ask that you fulfill the promises you have made to us. We know that your word is true and that you are faithful to keep your promises. 
As we trust in your promises, help us to remain hopeful and expectant. May we see the fulfillment of your promises in our lives, and may we be a testament to your faithfulness. Lord, we declare victory over any challenges that may be blocking us from receiving your blessings. We know that you have already overcome every obstacle and that through you, we can also be victorious. Help us to face our challenges with confidence, knowing that we are more than conquerors through Christ. Heavenly Father, we offer our thanksgiving for the blessings you will continue to give us in the future. We trust that you have more in store for us and that your plans for us are good. As we move forward, help us to remain grateful and open to the new blessings you are preparing for us. We thank you for hearing us and for the assurance that you are guiding us. Help us to remain aware, obedient, and grateful so we don't miss the blessings you have prepared for us. We trust in your timing, wisdom, and protection as we walk through life, knowing that you are always with us, working all things for our good. We give you all the glory and praise for your faithful love and the countless blessings you have provided. May our lives reflect your goodness, and may we always be open to receive all that you have for us. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Thank you, Lord, for your never-ending love and mercy, which are new every morning. I'm grateful for the gift of life and your daily provisions. Thank you for the many blessings you've given me, both visible and hidden. Please forgive me for the times I've fallen short or doubted your goodness. I also forgive those who have wronged me. Just as you have forgiven me, I ask for your guidance in every decision I face. Light my path with your wisdom and help me recognize your voice amid the chaos of the world. I trust your word as a guide for my life. Give me your strength when I am weak and courage when I am afraid. I reject fear and doubt, and I bind any attempts by the enemy to discourage or defeat me. I declare that through Christ, I am more than a conqueror. Lord, open the floodgates of heaven and pour out your blessings on me. I welcome your abundance in every area of my life, physically, emotionally, and financially. I trust that no weapon formed against me will succeed. Heal every part of my body, mind, and spirit that needs your touch. I reject sickness and the spirit of infirmity in Jesus' name. Protect me from all attacks of the enemy. Shield me from harm, danger, and evil. Guide me away from temptation and guard my heart, mind, and soul with your power. I dwell in the secret place of the Most High and find refuge under your shadow. Bless my loved ones with the same protection and favor. Guide their steps, strengthen their hearts, and shower them with your love. Heal their bodies, renew their minds, and restore their souls. Protect them from harm and draw them closer to you each day. As we pray together, I'm thankful for every heart opening to you now. We come in unity before your throne asking for your Holy Spirit to fill us and empower us to glorify you. We claim victory over every challenge, holding on to your promises. Bless us, enlarge our territories, heal our lives, and protect us from the enemy's schemes. We thank you for your faithful presence, for yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever. Thank you, Lord, for hearing and answering our prayer in Jesus' name. Amen. If this prayer has blessed you, please say amen. You can help us spread the message by sharing this video and liking it. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more uplifting videos. We appreciate your support. Feel free to leave your prayer requests in the comments so we can pray for you and others can join in. To God be the glory. May the grace and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe and turn on the notification bell to get notified anytime we post a new video. God bless you. Amen.